A. Fox Hi, in the building. <laughs> hey. hey, what's happening? Nothing. You. <laughs> Hi there. Hi. All right, let's get into this, Vivica. Um, hey. How did you get involved in Face the Truth? How did they reach out to you to get you to be enticed by this to want to do this show? Um, Face the Truth fell into my lap courtesy of Dr. Phil, who has become a really good friend of mine. He felt like this was a wonderful new chapter for me to go into my life. Um, I recently became an author. I did a book called Every Day I'm Hustling, where I was sharing my secrets of success. And now I have a talk show called Face the Truth, where I am helping people from everyday walks of life live better lives. So it's a wonderful new chapter for me, and I'm grateful for it. Okay, so the concept is people come and they present your problems as we look at the set there behind you, like to a panel, like to, is it a panel of experts? Uh, and then you decide, like you sort of, inter you know, get involved and tell them how to solve it or explain how the show's gonna work. Okay, well, when the guests come on our show, they face myself and my truth team. The truth team consists of Ariva Martin, our lawyer, Dr. Judy Ho, our psychiatrist, Rosie Mercado, our motivational coach, and Judge Scary Mary. And when the guests come on, <laughs> I love that you love Scary Mary. <laughs> <laughs> and trust me, she get, keeps it real, all right? And that's what you love about her. But anyway, they, they are my panel of experts. And when the guests come on, we offer them uh, takeaways, inspirational, and personal stories that we've all went through in our lives. And we hope that we can offer them sort of like, you know, a prescription to solve their solutions. So uh, in our notes, there's something called the creative sentencing. Personal issues. What is that? Creative about? sentencing. Yes, yeah. that's the prescription. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, creative sentencing. Yeah, that's the the prescription that we help that they can solve some of their personal issues that they're all going through. Oh. And I mean, we've got everything from big problems to small, from parent-child conflict to dating to personal bad habits. Mm. They're from all different walks of lives. And then we've got a couple celebrity guests that are going to roll through there every once in a while too. That I had to go through my rolodex and pull, right. some, pull out some favors. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I was just wondering about that, you know, who uh, the people are who come to you with their problems. If there might be uh, some famous names, can you give us any, uh, any little hints? Dish. Now you know you have got to stay tuned to see who's coming through. Come on. <laughs> but that's a great thing about uh, Face Your Truth is that every day it's going to surprise you with the stories and who the guests are because they're from all different walks of life. I know it starts on Monday. Uh, can you give us uh, an, an idea of like, for instance, like one of the problems that you're tackling on Monday's show? Oh, Monday premiere show, we have a mother and daughter that are going uh, through a conflict where the daughter is addicted to makeup. And it's gotten so bad where she's stealing from her mom. Her mom has gotten in debt. But what we find out more than anything else is that the different layers of it is that, you know, the child is just feeling unaccepted through, you know, all the things that kids go mm -hmm. through nowadays with social media and wanting to fit in. And it was very emotional and very intense to me. And um, I almost cried my lashes off. But, you know, we have oh. some shows that are very intense to then light hearted as well, too. Yeah, that's a very specific problem. But, but I can premier. see the ripple effect will help a lot of individuals understand if maybe that sort of thing is affecting them and their self-esteem and making them do other things that are self-destructive. Yeah, that's the reason why I really love Face the Truth is that it's helping me connect with my audience from all different walks of life. you know? Uh, that's what's unique about the show. And then also what's unique about the show is that our in-studio audience, they vote on who's right and wrong. And then the audience at home, they also can weigh in as well, too. So we're involving a little bit of everyone. And like I said, the main goal of Face the Truth is that we want our, our uh, folks to live a better lives and, and offering them practical takeaways and inspiration and guidance. Well, we can't wait to watch it. And uh, welcome to the CW on behalf yeah. of all the CWIs here in the studio and we'll Thank watch you. for Face I'm the happy. Truth coming up on Monday. Hey, uh, Vivica, uh, I love the fact you always keep it pushing, you always reinvent yourself, but I'm still waiting for a reboot of Out All Night with you, Patti LaBelle, Morris Chestnut, and <laughs> Dwayne Martin. Bring it back. You guys are all still here and you look great. I know. Every Everyone's doing reboots right, yeah. right now, so, you know, it might be time for us to bring out all night. Hey, Club yes, Chelsea. we may do a comeback with Head that. Head on over to Club okay. Chelsea. <laughs> hey, thanks for being on. Thanks for being I'm on. Good glad day. to remember that. That's cool. That was a great show. All right. Take Thank care, you, you guys. Check, Check out, out Face, Face the, the Truth. Truth. Monday, right. it uh, premieres here.